Give me five minutes. Eu só preciso de cinco minutos. Just five minutes. Only five minutes. My name is uh, Diara Alepembo Busengo. I'm Congolese. I'm awarded from University of Bukavu 2009. Since I came in Malawi from 2011, I went to Kamuzu Central Hospital in orientation. It was nine months, and after that, the medical council assisted me some addresses whereby I sent letters and uh, I got job. I've been working with Christian F Association of Malawi, CHAM, almost seven years and five months. I was principal medical officer where I've been working very hard in the rural area and I was so much appreciated. And later on, I've decided to assist the refugees by opening this clinic. The idea to open this clinic came up after evaluated the health services which is offered by the Galeka Health Center. We have seen that many refugees are struggling and the health center is so much crowded. That's why we come up to say we can open a clinic where there will be accessibility of uh, health services to all without discrimination and to assist those people in terms of barrier languages so that they should not be having a translator when they do seek the health services. We have got the license and all documents approved by the government and uh, we are working. In terms of department, we do have OPD, we do have uh, pharmacy department, we do have laboratory department, we do have also an observation ward, we do work with ART, antiretroviral therapy, we do have outreach clinic, uh, we do have uh, rehabilitation, nutrition unit, and uh, minor surgery department. We do have also another department of rehabilitation where we do have a physiotherapist. We do have a HIV test and counseling. In total, in terms of staff, we are 16 currently. We have three doctors who are working hand by hand together. And we have got a very good team, committed people are working to assist these refugees. In terms of chain supply medication, we started by our own with small medication. Later on, we receive some donors, uh, Ubuntu, send us some medication to assist uh, this uh, population. In terms of succeed, I can say that we have already started uh, to work here and the population are willing to seek health services 20 by 24 hours and the uh, workers uh, are committed to work hard and to assist the refugees. We do have many challenges. We don't have a motivation allowance of workers. Since we started until now, no one has got allowance. We're still making our sacrifice on our own. Uh, no one has a salary. That is in terms of human. But in terms of uh, materials, we have been running out of essential medication. We don't have an ambulance. Whenever we do have a case which needs a referral to the high hospital, the patient is supposed to look his own transport. So that is a big challenge which we do have. We could wish maybe in the future to have an ambulance. Whenever we have a very serious or a sick patient, should be transferred as quick as possible to the higher hospital to have a better management. Refugees are unable to get fully health care in this institution because of their income is very little. And uh, since we don't have any funds here, they do pay consultation fees, they do pay lab, laboratory, they do pay also medications. So we wish to have donors who will assist us so that after taking to partner this hospital, the refugee should be able to get free of charge medication, free of charge admission, free of charge everything which we will be doing to them. So each and every one who will assist us is so much welcome and we are going to appreciate that funds and that donation. And we will be giving any report which may need from us. 
थैंक यू